Hey guys, Barry here, and welcome to your gaming station, Nintendo Backed Gaming. And here we have an early hands-on of Quest of Dungeons. Now, a massive, massive thank you to David from Upfall Studios for giving me this early hands-on. As you are watching this, I have this game from last week, but it's not available until today. That's when the embargo is, you know, that's when we can put up the video online. So, basically, if you know what this game is about, Quest of Dungeons is a turn-based dungeon crawler game, a roguelike. An evil dark lord has stolen all the light, so your mission is to enter his lair and defeat him. The dungeon's layout is procedural, so you won't find items to enemies in the same place each time you play. Sounds pretty neat. So sort of like a ziggurat, as in each time you play it's a whole different experience, you know, which is pretty good. I like that. And same with kind of Seamoral Heist, you know, when you're on the 3DS and I'm coming to Wii U very soon. When you play that there, it's different each time, kind of. So, yeah. Okay, options here. You can do different stuff here. If you want, you can play with the uh, map and the gamepad when correct. And this game is coming to the 3DS. So, this is coming out tomorrow, the 29th of September. EU and US for $8.99. So, about €9, Euro, I think, as well, if I'm correct. And it does support cross buy with Nintendo 3DS. So, if you buy the Wii U version, you will get the 3DS version absolutely free when it is released. No exact date, but, well, as I speak. But there is, one, uh, when there is, you know, by the time this video is up online, I will put it in the description, I guess. So, okay. Sound here. Graphics, you can change the screen area there. Controller. Now, you can, you can change the controller if you want to correct pro controller and Wii remote I can't remember top of my head sorry but yeah leaderboard is there as well let's see who's there no results okay that's a good new game so we have four different characters here we have warrior this mighty warrior is specialized in hand and swords he's very capable in hand-to-hand -hand combat wizard a wizard is not very capable when it comes to the use of traditional weapons, but he can use powerful magic and spells. Assassin. Lurking in the shadows, the assassin uses ranged weapons to attack his prey. He's more suitable for ranged combat. And finally we have the uh, shaman, if that's correct. A shaman may not be the most powerful fighter, but he specializes in mixing spells with a close combat. So I'm going to give the warrior a go. Why not? So we can change the... Div. Level difficulty at the bottom. I see the X button there. Let's go to easy there, normal. Hard and hell. I'm gonna go to easy if you don't mind, so. <laughs> Regardless of any game I play, I'm terrible. <laughs> okay, so. Okay. In the land of uh, Viral, I think, a powerful and evil lord stole all the light, trapping it inside a magical lantern. Darkness spread quickly and ruthlessly. Four heroes join forces. You should go alone. What? <laughs> good idea. How is that a good idea? Divide and conquer. You have a sword. You totally have a sword. Not sure about this. We will stay here. Yes. Okay. What the fuck? Excuse me. He is so dead. <laughs> totally. It's a dark night with just a gentle breeze in the air. You finally reach the ruins of the old Amphor is it? Oh, yeah, mansion. But who knows what secrets and horrors lie inside? And will you survive? So we are generating dungeon here. So previous enemy, different buttons here. Let's, let's see. I love the kind of the 2D pixel look of it, it's pretty neat, I think. Yeah, so when I do get the 3DS version, I will do some gameplay, of course. Why not? Yeah, I'm just going to wing it and see what happens, will we? Should look, look at the bottom right corner anyway, so there's buttons there. And top left is your health, I'm guessing. Okay, what do we do? <laughs> I don't even know where I'm at. 
Okay. Oh crap. Yeah, I feel I'm gonna be really bad at this, so I apologize. What the hell? Really, David? Really? That's ridiculous. Let's go again. Here, I wanna do that again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See how different it is now? So A and B. <laughs> I do actually love the style. And it plays pretty well, actually. I'm afraid it touches a statue. Oh. Music is nice too. Yeah, you can't see on the bottom screen, but there is actually a mini map. So actually, let's go to start here. Options. Let's go to the uh, mini map. Let's. Hold on. Sorry. No, it's not there. Uh. If we can zoom in, can we? Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah. That's pretty cool. Let's go back out. Oh, so we can go auto pick from ground. Yeah, let's have a go with that. Yeah, it's a lot handier. Level up. Basically a lazy way. I don't know. So you can use the D-pad, which, uh, which is what I'm using now, and your analog stick. But it's like one of those games where it feels a lot natural using the D-pad instead of the analog stick, because it's just the way the game is. Oh, what the hell? Jesus Christ. Everyone's killing me. That's pretty cool. So I actually haven't seen any images of this game on 3DS running, but what I might do is after for myself, take a screenshot, you know, of this here, and save a screenshot from the gamepad to Miiverse and put it on 3DS and see how it looks. I'm starting to look pretty badass. Let's go back here. Where'd you come from? Okay, might need health here. Let's go to the uh, inventory. Uh, why is it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, there we go. Let's go this way. Can I need gem key? Hmm. Where shall we find it? Oh, jeez, you're the shit out of me. Level up. Ah. 
I love gold. That's somewhere around here. Oh, what's this now? <laughs> Something like out of... Music's a bit like Donkey Kong Country. But it reminds me of Resident Evil, you know, what are you buying? What are you selling? Listen to that music, that is deadly. Alright. <laughs> Square key, let's have a go. Getting this week, can we bite it? Ah, oh, we can't even buy it, any more points. Big time. Let's, can we sell stuff? Yeah, gold here. We sell this key. I'm gonna keep it just in case. Visit me once in a while. What does it say? Nice in business with you. Okay. Oh! I would love if Konami would release Zombies Ain't My Neighbors on Wii U Virtual Console, but they won't do it. No, no. Why would they? Or 3DS? That'd be pretty badass. Please, Nintendo, do something with it. Oh, this way. Oh, here's more stuff here. Didn't even see that. where we started. Don't go near that sign. stairs now. Sweet, hold on a sec. Let's go in here first. Wait, is that everything? What's this? Oh, nice. Okay, it's trapped in the garden. Okay, we've... What's that? Armor? Yeah. Go down. Oh, a portal. Nice. Was it here already? Yeah, it was. Oh, okay, we're here. Not too bad. Let's go down. New challenges, let's do this. Now, is that a tree or something? Now, imagine if, if Pokemon was like this. Like the original Pokemon. The proper Pokemon game. How cool would that be? Well, I guess it'd be a different experience, you know, compared to what it is now. You know, you take a turn. Oh, 
Okay, that's all right. Is that? Well, say it's very different from a lot of games that I have played, you know, on the channel, and you know, off the channel as well. I do like it though; it's pretty cool. Yeah, I've been called the Indie Guru from, uh, I guess you can tell who said it to me, uh, Bobby, the Nintendo Guru. I'm more Nintendo Guru than he is. <laughs> I don't know, I'm getting a feeling we're going to be going to a boss very soon. Which way do we go now? <clears throat> oh, this guy. Which Donkey Kong music. There, is that old stranger? What did I just tell you? Do you see that there? Hang on. <laughs> thank you. That's exactly, I was right. <laughs> see, little touches like that, it's really cool. You know. Oh, don't go near that trap, Jesus Christ. Actually, if he moves in the direction, he does attack back without you pressing the button, which is pretty handy. Oh, here we go. What are we saying to you? Oh, nice. Be the boss. What's this? Is the key as well? I don't know. Alright guys, I think we'll wrap it up there. Just a bit of gameplay, you know, about 20 minutes. Approximately, I don't know. Thanks so much for watching, hope you enjoyed this. Again, like I said, this game is out tomorrow in EU and the Americas. $8.99, $9.9 9 euro if I'm correct. Again, like I said, it is free on 3DS. I'm sure it's going to be, you know, the same way as if buy on 3DS, you get the Wii U version for free. Thanks for watching, hope you really enjoyed this. I did. This is pretty cool. David, thank you so much again. You can check us out on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch. And for more Nintendo and indie games, keep it right here. Thanks for watching, and as always, guys, stay fresh. <laughs>